What's up guys, I'm BTC, we got a brand new legendary skin for Zenyatta, an interesting interaction between Zarya and Reinhardt's Earthshatter, and Baptiste's Amplification Matrix Ultimate is broken. If you're enjoying the video, make sure you hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, subscribe to get more. Let's get started. First up, brand new legendary skin was just announced for the Overwatch League 2018 MVP, which is Jonak. This skin is going to be available from June 27th to July 14th. It's going to require those Overwatch League tokens that you get from either watching the stream or just outright buying them. It's probably going to cost 200 because that's what the other legendary skins cost. Now, the skin itself is themed around Jonak's team and some of the stuff that he likes so obviously it has those colors the red and the blue and it has a lot of the octopus stuff going on in fact it makes it look like it's not actually an Omnic anymore it's an octopus in a jar filled with water and it's like piloting some sort of robot body and then the little orbs that go around Zenyatta are also little octopuses as well or octopi, I guess, would be it. So anyways, the skin looks pretty cool, and again, it will be available pretty soon. Moving right along, quite often I get sent things from you guys asking me, hey, is this a bug, a glitch? Is this supposed to be working like this? What do you think about it? Most of the time, it doesn't really turn out to be anything big, but in the last couple days, I got two things that I wanted to share. The first is with a Zarya Bubble interaction with an enemy Reinhardt Earth Shatter. Now, I'm sure most of you are aware that if you're in the Zarya Bubble, then you don't get hit by the Earth Shatter. But anyone that's behind you also doesn't get hit by that Earth Shatter, so it's pretty good at blocking it. The scenario that was sent to me was a Zarya used a bubble on a teammate who was behind the enemy Reinhardt, and his Earth Shatter was blocked by that bubble that was behind him. Now, if it was in front of him, then yeah, it would make sense. You would expect it to work like that. But behind him, it seemed to be weird. But here's the thing. The Zarya bubbles are actually bigger than what they kind of appear. They block more of the area than you would expect. So because of this, when the teammate was behind the enemy Reinhardt, that bubble extended out into Reinhardt, and it actually puts that Reinhardt inside of the bubble with the teammate. So when he uses Earth Shatter, it doesn't actually go outside and doesn't hit anybody. As you can see in this example, I am standing right in the spot where the hammer goes down and the Earth Shatter appears, but I didn't get hit by it. Now this is particularly interesting with a teammate who is on Reaper because Reaper can move through enemies if he's in Wraith form. This means you can have a Wraith form Reaper move into the Reinhardt, bubble him, and it will completely stop the Earth Shatter in all directions. Because at that moment, the enemy Reinhardt is technically inside the bubble, and therefore the entire Earth Shatter gets blocked. It's kinda neat. The second thing that was brought to my attention was Baptiste's ultimate amplification matrix being broken. Specifically half broken because the damage amplification part still worked, but the healing boost did not. And as you can see from the hero screen and just the fact that Blizzard hasn't said anything about changing it, it's definitely supposed to be boosting the healing. Let's run some tests, find out if it's actually broken. I'm on Soldier, I have 200 hit points, I'm gonna damage myself down to 40 because Baptiste heals for 60. So when he hits me with his healing, it should bring me up to 100, which it does. So now I'm gonna heal the rest of the way up and then I'm gonna damage myself back down to 40 so it's the same consistent number. Now I'm gonna use Amplification Matrix and then try to heal. Only 60. It is definitely not working with the heal. All right, it doesn't work with Baptiste. What about other characters like Ana? So her regular healing is going to be 75, brings us up to 115. So we're gonna fill that back up and then reset it back down to 40. Then use Amplification Matrix and the heal is only 75. There's no effect whatsoever. Amplification Matrix does not work with it. I also tried it with the Bionade and Moira's Healing Orb, and it does not work. It is definitely broken. I then went and checked a bunch of different damage sources to see if that still worked. Hit scan, projectile, 
Moira's Biotic Orb, all of that stuff still worked exactly as it's supposed to. So the amplification matrix is definitely broken, it's exactly 50% broken, because the damage part still works, but the healing does not. And that's a pretty big issue because the amplification matrix, while it does have a lot of good offensive capabilities, it's also really good at healing your teammates, and now it just doesn't work. I haven't seen Blizzard say anything about this on Twitter or their forums or anything like that, so I don't know if they're entirely aware of this issue, but hopefully they do become aware of it and they push out a hot fix pretty soon because this is a big part of his ultimate and it just doesn't work. So there you go. Now if you guys ever find something that doesn't seem to be working quite right or you think that it's bugged, let me know about it on my Twitter or my Discord and I'll check it out. But what do you guys think about the brand new legendary Zenyatta skin? Are you gonna get it? Let me know down below. Thanks for watching, and if you'd like to see more, subscribe and hit that bell so you don't miss anything. Also, come hang out in my Discord server and my Twitch live stream. Special thanks to my Patreon supporters. If you'd like to see what kind of cool VIP rewards you can get, check the links down below. And remember, always, always blame the controller, because it's never your fault.